is a PRP kit. There are several types of PRP kit is there. So this is one of the PRP kit. So here we are having one test tube which have an uh, a gel and uh, anticoagulant. Normally this anticoagulant is acid cited dextrose and this is a kind of vacuum cleaner with which we draw the blood. So we will be drawing the blood. There are several size of test tubes are available. So here this can accommodate your 11 ml of blood. Some test tubes are there which can accommodate 8 ml of blood, some can accommodate 22 ml of blood and different other sizes of test tubes are available. So after we are mixing it, then we will be centrifuging it at 3500 RPM for 15 minutes and what will happen, RBCs are the most heavy, so that will be going through the pores within the gel and it will be accumulating there. And in the upper part, we will be having the platelet part at the bottom, just above the gel and above that there will be platelet poor plasma and we will be discarding the platelet poor plasma and we will be taking the platelet rich plasma just above the gel. So this form of preparation, this will be your leukocyte rich plasma because here we are not separating the leukocyte uh, from this. Recent studies are telling that the leukocyte rich and the leukocyte poor plasma don't have much difference particularly when we are going for, for the osteoarthritis knee treatment. So here in our patient is osteoarthritis knee and here we are preparing uh, this uh, leukocyte rich plasma. The drawing of the blood is just like drawing blood like the other phlebotomists do. Types of centrifuge machines are available. Earlier, people used to believe that the temperature regulated uh, PRP machines, centrifuge machines are better than the uh, where the temperature regulation is not there. Those uh, machines where the temperature regulation is there, that is costlier centrifuge machine and I tell that okay, no need of using those machines. You can easily purchase, so here we are having the two machines. One on the left hand side is temperature regulated machine, this is a costly machine. In Indian price, its cost is around 3 lakh machines, 3 lakh rupees. And on the right hand side, the centrifuge machine is non-temperature regulated machines. This gel always, this difference between these two machines is not there and recent studies are again telling the temperature control is not needed for to prepare the PRP. So we most commonly use the uh, not con temperature controlled machines. So here we will be using the other one and uh, that is not costly. Just only thing you remember that when you are purchasing a centrifuge machine for the preparation of the PRP, the RPM must be 3500 or more than that. Some PRP machines are there where the exact RPM is not displayed over the uh, the panel and second thing is some are, uh, PR, uh, centrifuge machines are uh, un uh, rotated uh, up to that level. Some machines where the RPM are maximum up to 2000 or 2500, those centrifuge machines are less costly, maybe around 10,000 rupees, but don't purchase those things. So you have to purchase the centrifuge machines where the RPM should be 3500 or even more. So that is the only difference. And uh, temperature control, if it is not there, the cost will be very uh, minimal in Indian currency. It's something around 30, 40,000 is enough. the centrifugation has been done uh, in the test tube we get the different layers this is gel below the gel we are having the RBCs RBCs are heavy it goes through the pores and it accumulates at the bottom and above the gel we are having the plasma and this plasma the upper part is platelet poor plasma and the lower part which is just above the gel is your platelet rich plasma. So what we do, we first will be putting the needle inside
and another needle both are sterile needle <coughs> and now what we will do we will take the upper part which is platelet poor part we are taking from above and we will be discarding this and after discarding this we will be shaking it so that the platelet which was accumulated at the gel will be now mixed up with the platelet rich plasma and with the other needle which is the smaller needle I will be drawing this platelet rich part So now this part is your platelet rich plasma, PRP. 